Hey, cheer up. You're not the first couple to have their romantic evening interrupted. Ah, the stories I could tell you. Kind of hoping you won't. Have you got nothing better to do? Uh, see you later. See ya. What happened to you this morning? Oh, well, I didn't want to disturb you. I get to bed till late. Oh, no, I thought Val had never let us go. Sorry she ruined the night. Oh, it's yeah, not your no, fault, no, is it? Anyway, she's not here now. Oh, hello. Oi, oi! Do you two never stop? Listen, your dad said to say that he'll be in tonight so he doesn't want to play gooseberry. Shouldn't you be at least trying to get some sleep? No time. Got loads of hotel ideas from down under. I need to tell Terry. <laughs> Bet Terry's going to love that. <laughs> You've only just come off a 24-hour flight. It's all right. I don't get jet lag. You don't get jet lag, do you? Better go. See you later. See ya. OK, bye. Does she never do any work? Hi. Once you can keep her hands off him. <laughs> Lucky man. Hi. Hi. I'm like, mm. What are you doing? Just paying my vet's bill. I wondered if you fancy lunch. Oh, babe, I can't. I'm on my own. I'm snowed under. No, it's all right. Just an off chance thingy. Well, look, if you fancy going out tonight for a drink, maybe we could go out of the village. No, what do you mean? <laughs> Mum collared me at breakfast. She wanted to take us out tonight. Obviously, I told her we had plans. Oh, right. What do you say that for? Well, because I don't want a repeat of last time, do I? But you don't actually <laughs> want to go out with her, do you? Look, at least she's making the effort. Yeah, but... Let's give her a call, all right? Just tell her we've cancelled our plans or something. Really? Really? Fine. I mean, if it all kicks off, I'm blaming you, all right? And I might even make you my speciality. Mm. I didn't even know you had a speciality. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's my round. Same again? Yeah, I'll have a pint, please. Yes, yep. please. I kind of preferred it when she didn't like you. I'll give her a break, Ryan. She's making a real effort. Mm. Although I am quite disappointed about one thing. What's that? Well, she still hasn't offered to get your baby photos out <laughs> when we get back. Yet yeah, she will, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, though, I, I haven't seen this cheerful for a while. Maybe she's got a new fella. Mm, maybe. Might even be a good thing. I thought we were going to spend some time by ourselves tonight. Yeah, well, that's not going to happen at your dad's, is it? Well, what about at yours? Jenny's there, isn't she? Anyway, we're supposed to be spending the night together. Yeah, well, it looks like this is the best option we've got then, doesn't it? Yeah. Look, are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine, why? Don't know, just... Uh, you seem a bit out of it at the moment, that's all. Hey, let me buy you two a drink. We're fine, thanks. We've just got some. Well, let me join you anyway. No, no, we uh, want to spend some time on our own tonight. If you don't mind. No, of course. And I wouldn't want to come between two star-crossed lovers, would I? <laughs> I'll see you later. Can I have a word? I got the impression that my company was distinctly unwelcome. Please. I'm begging you not to say anything about what happened between us. And I'd say something why? Why do you think? You've made it obvious that you're not just going to let this lie. I, I don't know what you mean. Yes, you do, Nathan. This is my life that we're talking... Yeah, it is. It just goes to prove that if little girls don't want to be burnt, then they shouldn't play with matches. What do you mean? It means I'll do whatever I want. <laughs> maybe I'll tell David. Maybe I won't. I'll have to wait and see. <laughs> 